All right, so in this video, I'm going to be doing a unboxing and demonstration of this Dremel electric engraver. So uh, there it is, it's the engraver itself. And then a small little number template or uh, number and letter template. Looks pretty cool. And it's made out of a uh, hard plastic. And it's not too hard, a little bit flexible, but that's pretty cool. And then, of course, you get all the uh, manual and warranty information, all that good stuff. It says it comes with two-year warranty. Uh, it has a little bit, and that's pretty much it. That's all it comes with this thing. I mean, it's not bad, I guess, for 24 bucks. Let's just hope it actually works out good. Yeah. You know? So in order to install your bit on the engraver here, um, you must loosen with a small flat screwdriver the uh, screw that's on the shaft here. And then I guess you can pretty much just, I guess it only goes in to a certain point and that's it. And then you go ahead and tighten it. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this thing in and Go ahead and do a small demonstration for you guys. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on, break it in a little bit. So, I went ahead and um, just engraved it there a little bit. It's kind of hard to see. It's really, really hard to see. Oh, wow, another one that's really hard to see. It, uh, it says RFS there for... Uh, Race Fab Shop, same um, RFS on here, but it does engraving on plastic. Um, it did a really good job on the metal, one. and it's not a bad little engraver. It has the uh, little hanging point here that's molded on to the Dremel tool itself. The on and off switch in the back, five settings, not bad. Um, especially for marking out tools. Uh, back in the day, um, we used to get um, engine paint or like the car engine paint. And we used to paint our uh, key wrenches and stuff like that. And nowadays, it's better just to engrave it because it's a little bit more hard to remove. That's the Dremel engraver. I want to thank you for watching. See you on the next one.